Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Electricity. I'm here to look into the radio wave and microwave environment of your bed. And the reason why we're going to do this is because I've noticed over time that if I sleep in this side of the bed, I get fatigued. If I move over into this side of the bed, I don't get fatigued. If I move back to the side of the bed, I get fatigued. And if I come back over to the side of the bed, it clears up. So something that very clearly is going wrong in my bedroom environment regarding fatigue. And I've done a few things to try and clear this up prior to doing this test that I'm going to show you right now. And I used to have a metal spring bed in here. And I changed it out, I actually changed it out to a wooden bed, and then I went one step further and changed out the mattress to a latex foam mattress, as there's a lot of information around saying that bed springs make you ill, and I can well believe it. So it didn't clear up my fatigue, so I got curious as to what's going on. I live very close to cell phone towers. So I got this radiation meter that records microwaves and radio waves, and this is the reading. So we can see that in this area we're getting about 11 to 12 near to the pillow. And if we come to the middle of this part of the bed, we actually get about 30 millivolts per meter. And if we come to this end of the bed, we actually get about 24 millivolts per meter. So let's go over to the other side. So this is the non-fatigue side. You can actually see the reading is much, much lower. So we're actually only getting about hmm, maybe six to seven in this area. If we go to the middle, we can see that the radiation levels have just spiked up. And when you're doing these tests, one of the things that you need to be careful of is if there's a cell phone in your home, which there is in this home right now, it's at the other end of the house, every time it connects with the tower, you're going to see a surge in the microwave radiation levels. And that's what we just saw. So it looks like it's passed. So we can see that we're actually back down to a very low level. And we're actually reading about maybe around 10 in this area. So if we go by the pillows, we can actually see that it's extremely low. It's almost zero. So I think it's pretty conclusive after all the tests that I've done that what I've actually been suffering from is called microwave sickness and radio wave sickness. And when you get those sicknesses from being in a high microwave environment, you're going to get quite sick. And in me, it showed up as fatigue. So I now sleep on this side of the bed. And I now avoid this side of the bed like the plague. So when I look at my bed today, what I see is this pillow equates to fatigue. This pillow equates to good health and I choose to stay in the good health side of the bed. So I just wanted to make you aware of it, is that there are patches of radiation in your home, and in particularly in your bed, that can actually make you sick. And uh, in some people it may actually make them much more sick than what it was showing up in me, which was fatigue. I hope you enjoyed this presentation, and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.